Sirs. Good morning, sir. We just spoke to you. Thank you so much for taking the time out. Uh, uh, we, are, we are witnessing a historic moment uh, in uh, global space history. What are your wishes for Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore as they make their way back to Earth? Mm. The entire country is looking for a safe return. And on behalf of Indian Space Research Organization and the country, I pray the Almighty for her safe return. Hmm. We are eagerly waiting for her safe return. Yes. And Dr. Narayanan, what and are the takeaways for the ISRO? As you, you as know, an, as an engineer, I'm. I don't have any doubt she will be safely returned back. Okay. Dr. Narayanan, if I could just ask you, what are the takeaways for ISRO? What are the big learnings for ISRO as we, uh, you know, look forward towards bigger missions that we are going to embark on? As you are aware, ISRO always learn the lessons from others' experience, always from our experience. Hmm. For example, uh, India is the first country which has successfully accomplished the Mars Orbiter mission in the first attempt. And for that also, we learned the lessons from all the colleagues, all other countries, and we have accomplished. Similarly, we are keeping watch of all the issues, what is faced, and we are going to take care of all the aspects in our mission in order to ensure grand, successful Gagnon mission in the first attempt itself. Mm. Dr. Narayanan, when you, you just spoke about uh, Gaganyan and the entire country is also looking forward to that big mission. It's going to be a huge step for, uh, for ISRO. When you talk about what you saw and the takeaways from this extended stay of Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore in space, uh, what are those learnings that uh, ISRO scientists are taking away? What are those two or three things that uh, scientists are going to now keep in mind when we embark on the Gaganyan mission? Number one, uh, when we talk about this type of uh, important uh, missions, hmm. you know, one is related to the uh, human rating of the vehicle. Second thing is the orbital module uh, related aspects. Hmm. In fact, we are building gain of redundancies and we are improving the reliability of all our systems in order to ensure the safety of the astronaut. We have to say in this hmm. mission, Mm. The key, the Gaganyan mission, the key aspect is the safety of the uh, our Gaganyan trees. That is the safety aspect is key mm. for us. And one is, in order to ensure they are safe, a couple of things has to be done. Mm. Number one, we have to maintain the required pressure, temperature, humidity, CO2 has to be kept under control. And those aspects, there mm. is a system called environmental control and safety system, and we are mm. working very systematically and uh, towards that development, mm. we are going through the process. Second thing is, in the process of uh, taking them, our Gaganya theories to the space, at any point of time, if anything happens to the vehicle, mm. we, have got to, we are building a system called mm. crew escape system mm. to save them instantaneously. Mm. And we are having a clear uh, monitoring of all the parameters, something around 300 parameters we are monitoring yes. continuously mm. and real time. And onboard computer system will act real time. Mm. Based on those things, if we, at any point of time, if any issues are uh, surfacing out, immediately mm. they will be saved through mm. the crew escape system. In fact, we have a couple of experiments we have carried out. Mm. And, uh, and now also we are going to continue those experiments. We are mm. to be done very systematically and meticulously, and we are direct carrying out those experiments. Absolutely. Next aspect is when they come, you know, the multiple phases are there in the mm. mission. Mm. And one is when they come back, uh, mm. there will be a lot of heat generated on the orbital module. Right. So the entire thermal system and design, mm. we are... The entire thing is done very, very systematically and it undergoes uh, perfect qualification aspect. Mm. Then, initially, they are brought down by, in fact, the vehicle takes them to 170 kilometers, the mm. human rated vehicle takes mm. them. The vehicle is fully human rated. Human rating means, say, compared to expendable vehicle, here we have to bring additional redundancies, additional thermal structure and margins. We have to qualify extensively. Those things are completely done today. 
Hmm. Second thing is vehicle health has to be continuously monitored. So hmm. many parameters have to be continuously monitored to ensure the vehicle is always healthy. So those things are all uh, completely done right now. Right. Then uh, from 170 kilometers they are taken to the orbit, somewhere around 400 kilometers by hmm. the crew, by the service module propulsion system they are hmm. taken. And this is put through extensive testing, multiple testing, mm. uh, and it is undergoing. Mm. Then they have to be kept in the orbit. Mm. And those times, a lot of things have to be done. As I told, environmental control safety, everything is undergoing extensive testing qualification. Right. Then in the return path, when you talk about returning, you know, the orbit model uh, rotate with high velocity. When right. you reduce there, we well, return, you have to reduce velocity and bring them. Yes. When you break the velocity, there will be a lot of heat flux generation. Hmm. And those aspects, uh, we have done theatrical studies, experimental studies, and all those aspects are addressed. Okay. Then the returning path also, the braking is done by a propulsion system called yes. the crew propulsion system, crew model propulsion system. In fact, so much of tests, tests are, tests, tests are done in subsystem level, integrator level, so much tests are done. I was uh, directly involved uh, in that program right. uh, because I was uh, leading the propulsion team. Right. So extensive testing are done. Then coming to the last phase, uh, they will be brought down by parachutes. In fact, nine parachutes have to work in a cohesive way. And this activity is done in, uh, 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 with the support of the DRDO lab yes. in Nagra. And so much work, outstanding work is done to ensure each system is separately tested, Ab qualified, and integrated module, you have to do the test. And then, of course, recovery aspect. Yes. Recovery aspect is also very crucial. Yes. In fact, if you take the entire mission, uh, starting from the vehicle building to take off, a vehicle has to take off and take them to space, keep them safely in the space, and bring them back safely, yes. and recover them, uh, it is a multi yeah, and Dr. Narayanan, this is it, it's it's always great to just listen to you because there is there is so much that one can just learn by listening to your experience and the way in which ISRO today is also, uh, you know, making India proud with every mission. I would have to thank you, but uh, we will, you know, we, along with ISRO, the entire country is also sending in wishes to both the astronauts who are coming back to Earth after nine months, a nine day mission that went on to become a nine month long wish mission and what did they do they did what uh, you know astronauts do they got down to business in space there they conducted more than 150 experiments uh, they took away a lot of learnings and they're bringing back a lot of uh, you know discoveries that they found out when they were in these nine months in space now let's also